Okay, so let's take a look at the watch. You can see as my hand approaches, it dynamically starts to react. <laughs> Note how the responsiveness and precision of radar enables us to create these continuous fluid interactions. Okay, but what if I want to interact with more detail? That's easy. I just move my hand closer to the watch, and now I can use a virtual dial gesture to interact with the complications. <laughs> So here you can see I'm using a virtual dial gesture to rotate through these various complications. So we've got the messages, the weather, and the calendar. These gestures represent interactions with, uh, with physical controls, such as using an analog dial. Because I don't have to touch the screen, we can get a lot more information on the display. And of course, just because they're micro gestures, doesn't mean I have to do them right next to the device. They also work at a distance. So, let's select one of the other applications, the weather, for example. I'll remove my hand, and now when I come back in, I can instantly look at what the next weather information is. So you can see, with just a few solely gestures, we can already start to build these rich interactions solely embedded fully on a smartwatch. So here SOI allows to control control de home devices from the distance without touching them. This is the very first you know, prototype, it's here of a speaker, very early work, but the, the idea here is exactly the same interaction principles and the same gestures uh, that we designed for watch also allow, also allow us to control the speaker. You can see, <laughs> woo -hoo. It's a different embodiment, but the principle is the same. As they're approaching his hand, you can see that the speaker recognizes it and reacts to it. So what are you going to do next, Nick? Yeah. So, so note that the interactions here are much larger than the watch. They're several feet. The sensor actually can sense up to around 15 meters. So we can do some pretty <laughs> amazing stuff with this. And this is the same thing that's in the watch. Okay. Same algorithms. So as I approach, I can now use the virtual tool to turn it on. Okay, let's try another track. What do you think? Next one? Yeah, that's pretty cool. Okay, but I can also do other gestures, more immediate ones, like shut it up. Great.